Lamu Governor Issa Timami says that Lamu East and Lamu West Deputy Returning Officers illegally swapped constituencies ahead of the August election. Timami insists that the elections for gubernatorial seat in Lamu were not free and fair, accusing IEBC officials of being impartial. Pama Governor Issa Timami was testifying during the hearing of a petition he filed challenging the victory of Ahim Toa told High Court Judge Lady Justice Dora Chepkwon who is sitting in Malindi for the election petition that the election was not administered in an impartial and neutral manner. Timami particularly took issue with the current Deputy Governor Abdul Hakim, a former registration officer and IEBC constituency returning officer of being behind the scheme to unseat him using his former colleagues at IEBC. Timami said Abdul Hakim influenced to have his former workmate in Taveta to be brought in as the returning officer for Lamu East, adding that his assistant was also a returning officer in Lamu West. To set up the machinery, have his people run the election. To have his people run the election. Asked whether he had evidence, Timami said some of his agents were thrown out of the tallying center. Further, he said there were pre-marked ballot papers marked in favor of specific candidates. As part of the scheme, the former governor said one of his names, which is famous in Lamu, Timami, was missing, adding that only Issa Abdallah was in the ballot paper. The former governor said names of voters, particularly in villages which are his strongholds, were missing in the kit. Timami said most of those rejected votes were also from his strongholds, adding that there was no value. Toha, who was present in court, is represented by lawyer Morris Kilonzo, while IEBC is represented by Peter Munyu. In the August polls, Toha was declared the winner of the gubernatorial race with 22,969 votes against Timami's 22,848 votes.